This video contains tips for typing with Android. Your options and screen appearance may vary depending on the type of device you are using, the app being used, and the version of Android that you have installed. The Android operating system has an on-screen keyboard utility that is enabled by touch. Select a text entry field, such as a web browser's address bar, to activate the keyboard. When the keyboard appears, some keys may change, depending on the type of field you have selected. For example, when a web browser's address bar is selected, the .com key will appear. The three dots in the bottom corner of a key indicate that it is hiding additional options. Press and hold the key to reveal the hidden characters. Other keys may have extra abilities as well. For instance, you can press and hold on the uppercase button to activate caps lock or on certain letters to insert an accent mark. Some versions of Android and various apps may include additional features such as gesture typing. This feature allows you to quickly insert words by dragging your fingertip across the screen in a continuous motion without having to lift it. As you are typing, Android will try to predict words and will give you suggestions in the blue text above the keyboard. Touch a word in blue to insert it, or press and hold to show more suggestions. If you want to zoom in on the screen, place two fingertips on the target area and then spread them apart. To zoom out, pinch your fingertips together. Double tapping on the screen will also zoom and resize the display automatically. To make a selection, press and hold on a piece of text until a blue box appears, and then drag the blue tabs to highlight the text you wish to select. A menu will appear that may include options such as cut, copy, share, and search depending on the type of text selected. To paste, press and hold on a text entry field and then touch paste. Another way to quickly enter text without using the keyboard is by using the dictation feature. To activate dictation, touch the microphone icon on the on-screen keyboard and begin speaking. For example, if I say Android dictation, the words should appear on the screen. There are also several voice commands to help you compose text, such as new paragraph and exclamation mark. Search the web to find more examples of voice commands. To access additional options for customizing your typing settings, touch Language and Input in the Settings menu. The Personal Dictionary feature allows you to create your own shorthand to quickly insert preset words or phrases while typing. Open the Personal Dictionary and then touch Add in the upper right corner. First, type the phrase you want to save and then type the shortcut you are going to use. The phrase you entered should now appear in the predicted text section of the on-screen keyboard whenever you type the shortcut you created. If you prefer not to use the on-screen keyboard, you can connect an Android-compatible Bluetooth keyboard to your device. On the Android device, open the section labeled Bluetooth in the Settings menu. Touch the on-off switch to turn it to the on position. Make sure the keyboard has power and is turned on, and then press the Connect button. The keyboard should appear in the Available Devices list. Touch the keyboard to pair it with your Android device. Enter the code on the external keyboard, and then press Enter. You should now be able to type on the Android device using the Bluetooth keyboard. Thank you for viewing this video. You can find additional helpful videos at hp.com slash support videos and on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash how to for you.